Well, now to an odd crime alert tonight out of Richmond. Someone went on a tire slashing spree in Church Hill, but only targeted Subarus for some reason. Well, this was the site that over a dozen Subaru owners woke up to Sunday morning. Some had two tires slashed, others had all four wheels flattened. Enzo Domingo is live tonight after speaking with some of those frustrated drivers. And Enzo, what are they telling you? Hey, good evening, Makia. You know, some of them may tell me it's just an inconvenience. They got to go tow their car, get the new tires, and all the costs that come with that. But for others, it means more. For others, these flat tires mean things like rescheduling vital doctor's appointments. If you happen to be awake early Sunday morning, you might have heard this sound all around Church Hill. Tires being slashed. This seems senseless. Those were this woman's tires that were rapidly losing air before someone runs from the scene. Winnie said she was out for an early Sunday run when she saw the flats, each tire now with these two to three inch stab marks. And they did it really quickly, so I don't know if it's an ice pick or whatever it is. Today I'm, I'm taking time off work to spend, you know, half a day to go get the car towed and replace all four tires. Richmond police tell me they do have a video of a suspect and that all the vehicles hit, over a dozen and counting, were Subarus. Only a block away, we spotted a handful more, including this one belonging to Kemper Galleon. Another veteran up the road, he came running down the street. He said, they get you too? And I said, um, yeah. He says today was blocked out for vital doctor's trips for his wife. I have a disabled wife that's going to be affected as well. And they need to, I hope they're watching and, and listening to this because it's a cascading effect. You can't make the doctor's appointment. You have to reschedule that. They don't have your tire size. That happens. Galleon says he's now set back a week and waits for tires on top of the repair work as they brainstorm how to get his wife to and from her appointments. All the while, these Subaru owners are left wondering. Why would someone do that? Like, is it something against Subarus? Is it against people in the neighborhood? We don't know. All right, back, back live out here now. That car that you're looking at, that's one of the few Subarus that are still left. It seems all the other ones that were targeted uh, happen to be towed away as of this evening. They were here this morning. Now, uh, according to police, they do have video of a suspect that they are reviewing, and you couldn't tell from that, but they do say that he had a beard, he was wearing black gloves, a cap, and eyeglasses. Now, police add that they are still canvassing the area so they can get a more exact number of how many Subarus were actually hit. In the meantime, we're live and on your side out here in Churchill. Enzo Domingo, NBC 12.